Oh, it's a stray with the reading for the collecting. Take what resonates throughout the rest. Watch out for scammers soliciting you for readings in the comment section. Really appreciate you all. Hope that everyone is well. Let's see, what do we need to know? I appreciate your good energy. Thank you for that. Thank you for helping my channel to grow. Um, and for your support of one another. Tower. I just did a reading about this. Tower. Only this is a different perspective because the tower was in the challenge position. So someone's going through a tower, a reckoning, an awakening, a faulty foundation is falling down. Something that's not based on the truth is falling apart. Um, the devil reversed. Someone who was operating in their shadow side is being weakened. Maybe they thought they were invincible. Um, or someone is shocked by how devilish and shadowy someone is or is. Um, or what they've been doing. Tower. Materialism. Obsession. Someone's like, some shocking truth about obsession. Some shocking truth about an addiction. Someone could be on something and going crazy. I don't think so, though. I think it's a, a shocking. Someone's shocked by... This behavior. Or some, someone shocked who's been operating in this behavior. Two of wands reversed. Sorry, swords. In the subconscious, they feel like they made a mistake. A trifling mistake because they felt invincible. Maybe they really embraced this energy that made them feel very powerful. I don't know. They never thought they could be caught. Someone is making something right. Power exchange. Someone's giving, someone's receiving in the recent past. Someone might have given some, someone something. Um, moving forward, Eight of Cups, reverse. Someone doesn't want to move on. Someone doesn't want someone to move on. Someone's afraid they're going to keep returning to the same situation over and over again. It's got a weird energy there with that tower. Queen of Wands in the upright in the near future. Feminine energy, very um, creative, passionate, warm, confident. Something about that person is of significance. Two of Wands. There's the Two of Wands. This was in the same position in the last reading. Someone's making up their mind. They're making a choice to move forward about something. Um, they, they know which direction they're going. Five of Cups reverse. Someone in the environment wants to get out of this grief, regret, and loss. They could be begging and crying. Not, they don't have to be, but some, someone or many people could be very upset. Seven of Cups. Someone's trying to figure out their options. They could be in a fog. There could be drugs involved here. Someone could be in a drug-induced haze. Someone could have tried to do that to someone else. Someone could have created some sort of confusion based on on drugs or try to keep someone in a fog because of this devil here this could be definitely um, some sort of substance abuse or addiction that's why i'm thinking that tower can have to do with like some something someone did under the influence or some bad reaction to something as well or someone's realizing that they've been being given something or something like that i mean Take what resonates. I'm not sure yet. I have to clarify. The outcome is... Outcome is... There's something about traveling here as well. I don't know why I'm seeing that. Um, <clears throat> Seven of Swords. This has to do with lying, cheating, stealing. Some sort of a lie. Someone's trying to be very... Um, tricky. Uh, Knight of Coins. This is about a long-term investment in something. Someone's been really giving something to someone for quite a while. Um, should they change the battery? So this is about a long-term commitment or investment in something. Very solid long-term commitment and investment in something. So someone is having a tower moment. Someone's shocked or a fa faulty foundation is falling down. This is a, a reality check. 
Someone could be very angry. They could be very obsessive and angry as well. That could be the other thing that's going on is that someone is like in some sort of obsessive rage as well right now. Um, a lot of emotions all over the place. Someone could be shocked by someone's obsession. Let's see here. So we got a tower moment. Seven of coins. This has to do with patience and planning. You reap what you sow. You put how much effort someone put into something. Having to take a step back now. The devil. Knight of coins. That's what we have right here. This long-term commitment to this devil energy. Or someone was committed to doing something with an uh, obsessive, like it's their job. Someone could be shocked about how someone invested their time or it's all coming out. Or something's blowing up based on how they, the results of their actions or obsession, they were very committed to this devil energy or something like that. Two of swords, someone knows they made a mistake. I mean, yeah, I would say so. In the subconscious, two of swords, four of wands. I feel like it wants to come out this way. It fell out kind of like that, but this has to do with like some sort of milestone or happy home, um, structured environment, stability, home. Um, six of coins, someone was giving something to someone. Um, someone lost something big big loss uh, having to do with inheritance or a business or something to do with marriage or generational wealth or windfall. Um, two of swords, because someone made a mistake, reversed, a trifling mistake. It has to do with like a power balance, giving, receiving. Someone lost everything. Someone had to give someone something. Someone could have asked someone for help because they lost everything. They made a mistake. Um, eight of cups, someone doesn't want to move on, reverse, the fool, someone's planning on doing something reckless, or they could be accusing someone of doing something reckless, queen of wands in the near future, there's a king of wands that's coming out here, something about five of swords, uh, someone wants, that wants to win at all costs in relation to this queen of wands, someone's trying to bully someone here. This king of wands is in the upright. This queen of wands is in the upright. So I'm not sure what this bullying is. Is I don't know if this king of wands is coming after this queen of wands. Or someone else is coming after the two of these people. Or because of this connection. Or because that's a couple. But they're in the upright. So I'm not sure. Um, there's something about someone trying to win at all costs. Or something like that. It's a conflict. Um, two of wands. Someone has made up their mind, they're making a choice to move forward. Something about lies, malice, shame, ten of swords, total defeat and ruin. Five of cups reverse. Someone is in remorse. Uh, they want they want forgiveness. Their emotions are all over the place. They want to there's someone is trying to feel better. There's some messages going back and forth or someone's made up their, their mind about something in regards to this queen of wands who is right here, two of wands. They've made up their mind, which is right here, two of wands, about this queen of wands. As far as this defeat and ruin and this lies and this shame, um, they want to send a message or there's something about a message, this queen of wands. They're going to send this message. They're going to make this choice. They're going to be, make a bold choice about this um, defeat, this betrayal, this loss. Someone lost everything. They're, they're, uh, def they're some lies and malice, making a choice about this lies and malice. Long-term commitment to this devilish energy. Shocking. Um, or someone's fault. Everything's falling apart. Uh, bitter truth. Seven of Cups. Um, seven of Cups. Some sort of illusion about whether options in regards to this person from the past where there's unconditional love. 
some sort of an illusion. Someone's worried about that or hoping for that or... I don't know. Um, someone, I see six of coins in the reverse. So someone doesn't want this power balance. They want to abuse their power. There's a king of swords here in the upright. This person is very just. They see everything. They have a lot of experience. Could be professional, masculine energy. This person's this person's in this somewhere around here. Could be hero, hero energy. An investigator, a judge, Archangel Michael. Someone is trying to get out of something here. They're lying and they're cheating. It has to do with this King of Cups and this Three of Coins, this masculine energy who could be pretty shifty, maybe not. Something to do with this group of people that work together. Um, someone's going to try and lie, cheat, and steal is the outcome. Or something about this person lying, cheating, and stealing is going to come out. Three of Cups, there's multiple people involved in this situation. Someone had a long-term commitment to something. There's a long-term um, commitment to, to doing something here. Um, so... I feel like one of the decks I want to clarify with is okay. So change and concern fell into my lap. Um, change and concern. And then something else fell on the floor. Change and concern about someone's pathway being blocked. So someone's been really working on something, and they're they're going through a tower. What they have to take a step back. They don't know what to think, or they didn't think something through. The Knight of Coins, a long-term commitment to this devil energy, trying to get this great fortune. Someone's obsessed with the fortune. Um, two of Swords, they made a mistake. Something about a message. A message. The message keeps coming up. They don't want this message to go through, but. They made a mistake about this message, not getting out there, not going through someone's milestone. Six of coins, something that there's a power imbalance here. This kind of wanted to come out. It has to do with someone's occupation. Someone made a mistake. Someone's losing everything because of that, I feel like. Or they tried to do that to someone else. That's what this two of swords is here, and it's here. It has to do with a message about someone's work or job or... So they're, they're, they're milestones. Someone was supposed to hit a milestone or something like that. There's a blockage here. Some investment. Someone put in a lot of time into something and now ever, they didn't think something through or they don't know what to think. Um, someone made it. Uh, uh, now they're going to do something. They're trying to get out of this poverty, poverty mindset or someone's trying to get out of poverty or something like that. But they're going to do something reckless. They don't want someone to move on. Now there's someone trying to win at all costs with this King of Wands and this Queen of Wands here who are both in the upright. Someone might try to interject to stop the flow or things going going more, getting more balanced. Um, it has to do with this message. Something's going to come out. It's this message they don't want. Someone doesn't want a message to get out there that they made a mistake about. It has to do with someone's like sense of belonging, celebration, stability. Uh, manifestation. Someone made a mistake about that. They, they, there was some power imbalance, something to do with someone's occupation. Someone's been very obsessed. Um, whoever this is, they could be still obsessed. Um, this tower, they don't know what to think. They're just exploding. There, there's a tower moment happening. Everything's falling apart. Ten of Swords, they're ruined. They're defeated. Ten of Wands, lies and shame. That's the choice. Someone's making a choice about that, too. I feel like that's why they feel like they're upset or angry about something. Maybe they felt, like, really entitled. Privilege Lady Reverse, like, they really want someone to be down. But they're losing their um, position or their respect, shame for lying, malice. And someone's making a choice about it, too, about which direction to go. And this person is upset. They felt like... They're so they're too obsessed to to believe it. 
this person is in despair or someone's in despair about this two of wands that someone's making about this lies, this malice, this shame. There's a message. It's about this message, eight of wands. Someone's in despair about it. That's what the tower is about, about this message, a choice that was made in regards to this queen of wands. Someone really regrets all of this. They want to get out of this. Someone's going to make a choice. They're going to move forward in regards to this defeat, this loss, this backstabbing, this obsession. Someone is upset. They don't want someone to move forward uh, to get out of poverty and or someone to get out of poverty. They're going to do something reckless. They could be saying if this person makes this choice about this, they're going to, you know, or they're going to just, they're out of control. They're planning on doing something out of control. Someone's worried about some illusion that's been created around some unconditional love from the past. Um, someone, something being made even. Someone getting what they deserve, not being able to abuse their power. Someone's really worried about that. Um, I feel like this person feels like they're losing control of the situation that they're obsessed with. Someone doesn't want to be part of it. They feel like they feel like disgusted or something. There's a message. Someone's trying to keep it back. This person doesn't want to be part of whatever it is anymore. They're, they've made their decision about the message. Um, this has to do with something happening in a house in regards to some sort of an illusion having to do with someone from the past where there's unconditional love and unfair power balance. It could be a structure where people work together as well towards a common goal, structured environment. Seven of coins. Um, someone's in really bad health. I feel like the outcome is just this person being, I still feel like this is exposure. Someone's lying, cheating, and stealing. They're trying to get out of something. It has to do with the King of Cups and a Three of Coins. So someone's very clearly in bad health in the outcome. Um, someone can't stop thinking or someone's really concerned about this whole situation, about this long-term commitment to something with this group of people. Um, yeah, I feel like someone's upset. There's a lot of people who are, there's more than one person who's in despair. I feel like someone's really shocked by some information. Someone's shocked that someone's not going to, go with the flow with them. They don't want to be part of this malice lies or someone feels like angry that they can't, that someone's challenging them. They're challenged their, their obsession. Someone's obsession is being challenged. They're upset by that. Deep down, they know they made a mistake and there's something about a message though. They might be fighting over the release of a message or something like that, or truth coming out in regards to this queen of wands. That's who they've been trying to block. They, they, there's something about someone's occupation or their milestone or someone tried to block someone. There's some evidence of it. Someone feels very satisfied with trying to block this person. And it's like that is the, that's what keeps them alive. Almost they're so obsessed. And it's so disgusting though. Someone doesn't, it's all coming out. This person's in bad health. They're, they're in bad health. They're, people are in despair here. Or this person appears to be in despair. They're very upset. They could be... Um, having some sort of an outburst. Um, and it has to do with this queen of wands. It's like creative feminine energy. Who's very warm and passionate and creative a message. There's messages going back and forth or someone's in despair and someone has definitely chosen what they're going to do about it. And it has to do with some sort of message or something like that. And someone's just exploding over, over this choice. They, they, there's like an, an, an entitled fury, uh, ab about this right now because someone just wants to keep doing whatever this is but it's like this there's a total betrayal here as well someone's defeated ten of swords this is hitting rock bottom whatever this is this is like too far or something feels someone feels disgusted by it by being near near it or something or they've had enough they don't want to be part of how 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 severe this is something like that um, there's supposed to be a long-term commitment to this, but someone's just very concerned about what's going on with this group. And I feel like they have the powers in this person's hands. It could be whistleblower energy or something like that, but someone, they have no control over this other person and there's, they don't have anything over this person and, and they can't control this message. They made a mistake, whatever they did, trying to stop this message from getting out or whatever it is, they, they, I don't know if they created a lie or they blocked something or what they, yeah, they did. They tried to create, they used their power. They abused their power. I'm not sure where that got cut off, but, uh, yeah, someone's been very committed to whatever this is. They feel an entitled fury. 
someone wants out. This feels like too much. This long-term commitment to destroying someone, this obsession, there's something here. There's defeat, shame, malice, and lies. Trying to turn someone upside down or ruin someone. Someone's losing their own reputation being around this and made up their mind.